tucked away behind one of Nottingham City's centre streets, is a campaign project, Smile Stop Hate Crime, which is run in association with MenCap and both the county and city council, is one charity in Nottingham that is more than aware of what victims of hate crime can face. That people with learning disabilities are living in the community and I think hate crime has been happening to them as they live there and it's just not been known because people with disabilities and particularly learning disabilities struggle to know what it is or how to deal with it, what to do about it. And that's why Smile Stop Hate Crime was set up, really, to, um, to tell the public and people with learning disability, you know, what is a hate crime? Yeah, you're being affected by it. Now, what do you do about it? You go, you know, you must go and report to the police. That is our basic message. Um, that they should report it either to the police or to Stop Hate UK. According to Stop Hate Crime UK, over 200 calls from Nottingham were recorded last year from victims of hate crime, the most being from people with learning disabilities. The organisation hopes that the 13% increase in victims reporting this kind of hate crime means more people understand how to deal with abuse. Yet students here at MenCap believe the project has helped them move on. And I just try to get on with me life. Don't think about it now. Just try and get on what I want to do and enjoy myself and meet, make friends and meet people. Since victims are often left feeling isolated in society, this charity hopes that the recent rise is due to people realising how to report these crimes. Manetta Pierre, CBJ News.